If it is. Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumors that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Ugh. Could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Oh, Uncle Roland, what have you got yourself into? Perfect. Target practice. Come here, crap. 
corrupt my... Could this be Mr. Oaks' campsite? Van Rock's loyalists, just ahead. Should I take them by force or be discreet? Akio! <laughs> Arresto momentum. Incendio. Protego. Arresto momentum. Incendio. Now to find out what happened here. You only have Ranrock to blame. Revelio. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Adelaide said that her uncle kept notes of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. Revelio. A rock formation? That's the first landmark on this map. Now to find the crooked tree. A crooked tree, just as the map said. The crumbling tower shouldn't be far from here. Figure out why there's such a fuss over. Ha! Ha! Time to cheat! Oh! What have you done? Huh? <sighs> Levioso! Protego! <laughs> Levioso! around here can sleep a bit easier now. Revelio.
and the crumbling tower. The spot on the map should be directly south of here. Flipendo! Confringo! Revelio! Bombarda! What do we have here? Trouble. Hmm. I may have more luck higher up in the keep. A ladder. That's what I need. This is the spot on the map. I'd best have my wits about me. What will we find in here? Revelio. It looks as though Adelaide's instincts were spot on. Somebody! Anybody! What's down there? I'll get you the medal that I promised you! First you must let me out of here. I'm certain we can come to an agreement if you'll just set me free. Revelio. Hello? Mr. Oaks? Yes, I I'm here. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I have experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. I need to find Mr. Oaks' wand. Where could it be? Boiler door. How to open it? This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free. Pass 
through my wand. I can't get out of this damn cell without it. It's my last hope. Please. my wand and wait you're a student oh we must get you to safety immediately it's dangerous it's all right mr oaks i've dealt with these goblins before dear merlin you're either very lucky or very talented well, how did you find me i'm a friend of adelaide's she was worried about your business with ranrock's loyalists oh she was right to be i couldn't go through with the agreement and when i told them i ended up blindfolded and behind bars been locked in that infernal cell for so long they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasted goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Mr. Rokes was lucky. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. <laughs>